Claire Harris, I'm the Deputy Editor of Outdoor Photography Magazine. Um, we're at the print space in London to showcase the best nature images in the world. On the show we've got um, all of the winning images from the 2011 competition. We received um, thousands of entries from all around the world and the images um, you're seeing here today are the very best. We went through a very difficult but very enjoyable task of choosing the best ones. There were 12 different categories, um, ranging from British wildlife to world landscapes and everything in between, um, including a new Spirit of Adventure category. Hi, I'm Bertie Gregory. Uh, I won the youth category for Outdoor Photographer of the Year. Uh, my picture of a raccoon was taken in Stanley Park uh, in Vancouver. I found a group of them playing in a bush, knowing that they'd be quite curious because uh, some people often feed them. Uh, I lay down next to the bush and uh, they all came out to, to investigate me and the, the one pictured uh, came right up to the camera and then I noticed it, it caught its eye, uh, the reflection in the lens. So I got up off the ground and it copied, it stood up on its back legs and then it, it looked straight down the lens as you can see and uh, that's how I got the shot. The award means a lot uh, to me because it's great to get recognised uh, in such a prestigious magazine. Uh, and it's just it's great to, to see you work on the wall and have other photographers critique it as well, which is one of the most important things. I'm Mark Sisson. I'm fortunate enough to have what I consider to be the best job in the world, which is that of a professional wildlife photographer. I've been really fortunate to win two categories as well as the overall title here today. Um, one was the on the wing category, which was uh, a shot of some sandhill cranes in the early morning mist at a fantastic reserve in New Mexico called Bosque del Apache. The second shot, uh, and the one that won the overall competition, was uh, a little group of bison heads down battling their way through a blizzard and it was taken in Yellowstone National Park. Uh, and I've got nothing but admiration for them. They're amazing animals and their ability to survive all the way through those incredibly harsh conditions is absolutely fantastic. I'm a big fan of outdoor photography as a magazine. To win their competition in an only its second year is absolutely fantastic. It's something I'm really, really proud of and, and feel privileged to have won as well. Print space has been fabulous to work with. The private view is awesome. It's, uh, it's packed. It's a lovely gallery. I think the, the printing of the pictures and the images on the walls look really, really good. Oh, the exhibition was great. Like the photography in there was unreal. Like, it was pretty there phenomenal. Was some amazing stuff. And for my favourite type of photography, being out outdoor photography, uh, I thought it was absolutely amazing exhibition. And um, yeah, I was really blown away by some of the pieces that were there.